Welcome. This is a guided tour of Alberta's new FOIP request service. This online tool allows applicants to submit and track FOIP requests, pay fees, provide identification and documents, and receive response packages, all within a secure environment. To access this service, open a web browser. We recommend Chrome and enter foip.alberta.ca. This will take you to the page you see right now. To begin your request, click that To Make a Request Click Here button. On the following screen, select the first option, I am submitting a request as an individual or on behalf of an individual, if you have a My Alberta Digital ID account. Select the second option, if you have a My Alberta Digital ID for business. If you do not have an account, click Create Account. In this guided tour, we will log in using My Alberta Digital ID personal account. When prompted, enter your My Alberta Digital ID, username and password, and click Next. Once logged in, you will now be in the FOIP Request Service homepage. The homepage is divided into three sections. The top section is where you can make a request or view existing FOIP requests. The middle section is where you can view FOIP requests completed over the past few years. The bottom section is where you can make a request to correct your personal information. Similar to the top section, this section allows you to view existing requests. In this guided tour, we will make a new information request by clicking the Make a New Information Request button. On the right-hand side of this page, this will take the user through a simple, guided five-step process. In step one, you will be asked to select the category that best applies to you, as well as describe the records you are requesting as part of this request. Once everything is filled in, click the Continue button. In step two, you provide detailed information, including which public body the FOIP request is meant for, the request type, either general or personal, the record search date range, and some additional request options that you can adjust or leave in the default setting. At several points along the way, you will have the option to save your request for a later time without submitting it. In Step 3, you have the ability to upload any support documentation to support your FOIP request. This is an optional step that can be skipped. Once you are done with Step 3, click Continue. In Step 4, you will be required to pay the $25 application fee if you are filling a general information request. Click the Pay Select Fee button, which will redirect you to the My Alberta eService site. Once you have paid the application fee, you will be redirected back to your FOIP request, where you can submit your FOIP request for processing. In Step 5, you will be presented with a summary of your request with the option to return back to the home page. From the home page, you can view the details of your submitted requests add additional documentation, and pay any future fees related to that request. While there, you can also work on incomplete requests or submit completed requests that have not already been submitted. If you are finished, you can log out of the FOIP request service. You can check back at any time to check on the status of your request. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoy using the new FOIP request service.